Hey dolls! All right, so today is the day of my meet and greet or my meetup or whatever. Oh my gosh, my tan. I did like a self tan and it looks atrocious around my wrists, but like the back of my hand looks good. It's just like right there, it looks a little funky. Uh, but yeah, today's my meet and greet. So this little pimple zit friend decided to meet me today as well. Um, I'm about to do my makeup. So we will see if I can't cover this guy up. Um, I'm feeling like a kind of glittery cat crease eye, maybe some wing liner, and these are the lashes I'm gonna be using. They are the Ardell Double Ups in the 207 Block. Um, just for those of you who are, a lot of people ask me what eyelashes I wear when I do um, makeup looks. So I'm going to be wearing those ones today. And then I painted my nails this pretty color. It is the OPI in the shade Kiss Me, I'm Brazilian. And yeah, so with that being said, the next time you guys see me, my face will be done up. And then I'm going to be curling this mop on my head. So uh, yeah, I will see you guys in a bit. All right, so my face is done. I did a little bit of a sparkly cut crease type thing. I haven't done my lips yet. I like to do that very last minute, like right before I leave the house so that they're fresh and ready. Um, I just got done curling my hair using my New Me 5-in-1. I think this is the one inch barrel. And now I'm gonna go change. And actually I might not change just yet because it's only 10 and I'm probably gonna leave here around 1040-ish. So I have about 40 minutes before I have to leave and I don't wanna change and then accidentally spill something on my outfit uh, so yeah I will um, catch up with you guys in a few when I change so I am about to put my shoes on I'm gonna be wearing my why are you little twin stars platforms um, they are a size too big for me so I have inserts in them and I'm also this part right here where the tongue is it rubs on the top of my foot like the front of my ankle really really bad so I always put a band-aid on my foot before I put these on right where that would be rubbing just so it doesn't cause any annoying blisters and then of course I will be wearing some frilly fluffy white sockies so I'm gonna go ahead and put those on real quick I just wanted to show you these kind of up close and personal because uh, I can't really show them once they're on my feet so uh, yeah there they are and I'm gonna get dressed now all right guys so here is my outfit for the meet and greet. Um, my top I got from a store called Gen X. It's just a basic white crop top tee type thing. My skirt is actually made from one of my friends, Cindy. Uh, she has a Depop shop. I'm hoping that she will make it to the meet and greet so I can show her to you guys and kind of promote her work because she is so stinking talented. It's just like a pink gingham with this little detachable bow at the waist and this uh, little lace detailing so 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 cute okay so um anyway that's my skirt i love it thank you again cindy for this skirt i love it uh my shoes i just showed you guys so i'm not gonna get too much into those you guys saw my socks as well um i'm all out of breath because i'm getting too excited uh my necklace i think is actually um from nifty vintage girl or nifty vintage necklace but i took off the uh pinkie pie pendant that was hanging right here so i could just have some pink pearls uh, my bracelets the clear one is actually from cindy as well and the white one i don't remember where i got it then i have this little star ring that i also got from cindy uh, my headband, my little pom-poms are from Hot Topic, and of course you guys know my engagement ring, so I don't have to talk too much about that. Um, but yes, that is my little OOTD for my meet and greet. Yay! I'm very excited and super stoked. We are here. We are here. There's mom going to look at my little sign on the door. It says like, meet Manda or something like that. I'm not quite sure, but there it is right there there's my sign <laughs> there's my face <laughs> anyway yeah we are here i'm just waiting for one of the girls that works here to open the doors because they're not officially open yet they don't open until noon for the meet and greet um we're not able to get in just yet because the girl who works here isn't here just yet 
but we went over to Dairy Queen and I got a, my makeup looks so good today. Oh my gosh. Um, <laughs> Ma did her makeup too. I'm pretty. <laughs> Well, you're beautiful without makeup and with makeup. I got a strawberry banana orange Julius because it's delicious. Any holes. Yep, we're just waiting. And like I said, my other friend couldn't come right now. And my other other friend couldn't make it, period. So that's sad. I'm so sad. I wanted to take cute photos with her. But anyway, hopefully a lot more people will show and it's gonna be good. Oh, I didn't show you guys. I got, did I tell you about the Snapchat filter? I think I did. But here is the little, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little Snapchat filter. I'll like insert a photo of it so you can see it better. But yeah, yay, yay. She just got a Pepsi. It's good, it's good. It's good. It's good. <laughs> so what they did is inside they put all of the items that I had donated on one rack in the very, very front. And I haven't gone in there just yet, but I think maybe they're doing like a sale on them too. I'm not totally sure, but I guess we'll find out. Do you have anything to say? Me? Oh, it's a beautiful sunny day here. Yes. Hot. And it's going to be wonderful. And we do have security. Um, for those of you who are curious or concerned or anything like that, we do have security. We have one of the officers from the police station coming the in. The Kennewick Police Department. Yes, the police department. Um, there's gonna be an officer here, just kinda hanging out, observing, and all that stuff. So hopefully it will all be safe and everything will go hunky-dory. Okay, so here is the little set up at the table got my photos my little Instagram thing <laughs> my phone <laughs> there are the giveaway prizes got a party balloon and these balloons and then my photo backdrop and here is the store yay and then at the front right up here is where they put a whole rack of all of the things I donated. Yay! Okay, so I have my first guest. This is Trinity. She's actually a friend of the family's daughter. This is Danny. Subscribe to Danny Danger 509. Is that your username anymore? It's Danny Stranger. Danny Stranger. You changed it. I did. Yeah, I okay, well, subscribe then. to him on YouTube. <laughs> Do you have anything to say? No. <laughs> What's your YouTube channel, maybe. Can we do that. What's your YouTube channel? Yeah. Trinity07. Trinity07. T-E-M. T-E-M. There you go. Yay! Okay, so hold on. Let me focus it real quick. Uh, you don't look bad. You're fine. Okay, so this is Cindy. She's the one who made my skirt. She's like, don't make me talk. I'm too shy. <laughs> You're fine. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Who's got the loudest voice in this group? Me. Me. <laughs> Come on. Drew. Yeah. All right, you guys ready? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just squish in super tight. There we go, that's perfect. <laughs> All right, so what are we doing for today, guys? Well, I'd like to introduce Manda. She's a, our little YouTube star that's from the Tri-City area, and she's coming here today to help us raise money for Children's Hospital. And then I heard that, Diana, you yes. actually contacted me. Already. Yes, so I thought, what a great way to, you know, get someone from the community who has such a big platform that will help us, you know, spread the word out even more. We've been trying so hard, so she's got over 200,000 subscribers, so I thought, even around the world, whenever someone visits, you know, they can stop by. Perfect. And social media is so big these days, like YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, you name it. People yeah. are really paying attention to that stuff, so yeah. are you feeling pretty special being there? And being I, I feel people? awesome to be able to promote something positive while giving back to a charity. So, awesome. 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 And then what do you have to say to any fans that come out here today? Um, any fans that come out here today, I just want to say thank you guys so much for your support. I've been doing YouTube for about six years now and it's been such an amazing journey and one thing I stress so much on my channel is to be yourself and love yourself and stay true to who you are and to be able to just say that and promote that while giving back to children is so amazing. 
I get that for sure. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my god, yeah, this looks awesome. <laughs> awesome. So tell me a little bit more about how you got into YouTube in the first place. Um, I actually graduated high school in 2011. I didn't know what I wanted to do with my life. I was completely clueless. I had no clue. And I started watching other YouTubers, other YouTube videos. And I got super inspired. I was like, okay, you know what? I'm going to try this. I filmed a video. I deleted it. I filmed another video, I deleted it. And then I was like, you know what? No, I gotta have the courage, I gotta do this. And I posted it and then it just started slowly taking off and then it got bigger and bigger and then the bigger it got, the more professional I got with it. And it's just, it's such an amazing feeling to have grown this far. And it's kind of a cool way to say like, hey, not everyone's path is the same. Exactly. You step out yourself. Mm -hmm. Now yeah. I've gotta ask you, was your hair pink before YouTube? No, I'm actually naturally blonde and I would bleach it for like until I was about in my 20, early 20s, like 20, 21, I had blonde hair and I decided to go dark. So I dyed it like black and it was black for a while. And then there was a short little period on my channel where I started wearing wigs and playing with my style and changing up my looks like every day all the time. And then it was just a couple months ago that I decided to go pink and I have not felt more like myself. <laughs> That's so cool. It's funny, I actually have a cousin who's very similar. She literally just, you know, had blonde hair growing up, dyed it super dark, mm -hmm. and then one day we uh, we were in New York there, and she's like, I want blue hair. And I was like, all right, let's go get you some blue hair. And she says the same thing. She's like, I've never felt more like myself. And it's kind of cool, because you were saying, like, you know, individual style, you're born as an individual, and I think you kind of embody that, right? Exactly, yeah. Well, first and foremost, people think of a YouTuber and they think of, oh, that job is so easy, I could do it. But there is so much more you have to put into it than just filming a video. You have to put in your, you know, your lighting, your camera angles, your editing process. One video can take me up to 10 hours just to produce, even if it's just sitting down talking to the camera, because you have to edit your cuts and add your intros and outros and all of that kind of stuff. So first and foremost, it's it's a lot more of a difficult process than people assume it to be. Um, but on my daily life, I do actually also work a part-time job. So I kind of balance my YouTube channel within that or around that. And I just get up, I go to work, come home, film a video or two. And then over the next couple days, I will edit them and post them. What do you do for your part-time job? I work at a local bakery, Art Fetty Cakes, behind the mall. Yes, I do. I know we do. Oh <laughs> I go and get the macaroons there all the time. Okay. <laughs> wow. Okay. Mind blown. Okay, guys, we're gonna do the first raffle for one of the uh, gift surprise gift bags. So it's not gonna look. <laughs> okay, I got one. I got one. I got one. Oh, they put names on them, and it's Trinity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yay! yay! Come here, Trinity. Pick which one you want. Do you want the My Little Pony one or the Barbie one? My Little Pony one? Yeah. <laughs> All right. There you go. You got lots of stuff in there. Woohoo! Yay! Yay! Yes. Okay, I'm going to give you this purple one so you can let it go with us outside, okay? So you let it go in the sky, okay? <laughs> okay. You might want to have time to hold the pink one for you. Yeah. There you go. Are you ready, Cindy? Uh, well, <laughs> who cares? <laughs> okay, we'll go out, kind of like right here. Okay, we're gonna let off these balloons. All right, here ready, go. guys? One, two, three. Whee! <laughs> oh, they took off! <laughs> Yay! So the meet and greet's over, and we're gonna go get food. I'm with Tatiana, and we're gonna meet my mom there, and we're gonna have some lunchy lunch. Well, yeah, lunch. Lunch time? Like dinner time? Lunch it's like, dinner. It's, yeah. it's, it's linner time. So we're gonna go eat some of that, and then we're gonna, yellow light. <laughs> You're a great driver. <laughs> and then we're gonna go get Froyo. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Surprise, we're already here. We just left the place, and here we are at lunch. Okay, bye. Okay, so we all got the same thing. We are at a restaurant called Casamia. 
I don't know. Is that local or is I it like so. everywhere? I think okay, I think it's There's local. There's one in Ridgeland too, but okay. it's pretty okay. local. So, yeah. Well, anyway, we got spinach cheese ravioli, and I've never had this before, so it's we're good. we're gonna try it. Okay, I'm gonna taste this thing. Ready? Wait, oh, my camera is blurry. Oh, but yeah, there it's we really go. Really hot. We good? Okay. We're good. It, so. <laughs> <laughs> she did. She recommended it. She's like, you guys gotta get all this. And so we just got all of it. Well, she didn't say that, but we're like, ooh, okay. That sounds good. Let's get it. So yeah. A plus for me. For Rodeo time. Hello. Hello. Look at your hair. Thank you. <laughs> I just got back home. I uh, don't mind the messes behind me and everything. I'm just gonna show you a real quick a little holly haul of everything that I decided to get today at the meetup. Uh, before I get into this, I just want to say a sincere thank you, thank you, thank you to anyone who showed up and came out today. It was really fun and I had a great time and I hope it wasn't too boring for some of you guys because we had snacks and prizes and stuff. But other than that, it was kind of just shop around and just mingle around and try to not be bored and I didn't I wasn't bored at all and I really hope that you guys had a good time for those of you that came out. Uh, but yes, uh, anyway, with that being said... Let's get on into this. I just got a couple things. I didn't go too crazy. I got this little kind of corally camisole. It's got a cute little lace detailing on the top. And then I got these like pants. They're kind of like a periwinkle color. They're not really blue. They're not really purple. They're kind of like an in-between color. Um, but they're kind of like leggings. They're just kind of kind of like loose fitted leggings probably but they're cute these will be nice like pajama bottoms or something and then I got uh this this is an off the shoulder shirt I thought would look really cute with maybe some leggings or maybe even some shorts or something but it's just like a light blue color then I got this top I'm like so out of breath I've been out of breath like all day even when I was getting interviewed by the news crew and stuff I was just like <laughs> I'm just so out of breath it's so hot here too um I got this mint shirt it's just like a basic it's kind of a thicker t-shirt so this will be great for layering and stuff in the fall months and such um, but it's just like a mint basic shirt and then the last Thing I got is just this shirt. It's very simple. It's just white with little, I got an itch in my nose. Hold on. I promise I'm not picking boogers. <laughs> so I got this uh, white and black polka dot little kind of, it's kind of flowy shirt. Like I got it big on purpose. It's a medium, but it honestly feels kind of like a large or extra large, but it's long. So this will be a, another perfect like little night shirt or maybe to pair with leggings in the cooler months as well. That is everything that I got at my little uh, meet and greet place. And just again, thank you guys so, so much for coming and hanging out with me. It really was fun and I enjoyed every minute of it and I'm so thankful um it was it was really special and awesome and who knows maybe we'll do another one in the future they said they had a really good turnout and that was like the busiest Sunday that they've had at the store in a really long time which is amazing because if we can help out for this type of charity event then that is so cool and I'm so appreciative to give back and everything and uh for those who won the little raffle baskets they had one of my like so long stay strong stay true and bu pillows in it i'll go ahead and grab it so you guys know what i'm talking about i have these on my ray john shop uh which is always linked in my description boxes 
but it's just this pillow right here. So long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. They, bo they both got one of these, and then there was like a coloring book in there, but it was like Disney themed. It had like Marie in there and everything, and Bambi, and like all my favorites. And then there were some Glam Glow items, which you guys saw from my Snapchat. There were like three different face things from Glam Glow. There was a $25 Ulta gift card in each one. There were some Sephora face masks in them. There were a few lipsticks. Um, I'm trying to think of everything else. Um, I think I got a palace pet and a My Little Pony, one in each. And yeah, it was just a really, really fun time. And I really hope that the people who showed up had a good time as well. I ate my Froyo and I'm all full now. Dinner was delicious, or lunch was delicious. Um, the news is gonna be on in half an hour. It is 5.30 right now. So I'm gonna get in my comfy pajama loungy clothes, look through some of the pictures that my friend Tatiana took today. Um, she took some with like the balloons and like the little party balloon and oh, thank you so much Tatiana for like taking my photos and hanging out with me for the day. It was just, it was just a really good day. Like I'm so happy everything turned out so great. Um, the turnout wasn't huge. We didn't have like 500 people show up or anything like that and that's fine. I am so appreciative of just like one person showing up and more than one person just showed up. So it was really special and just like I said on the little news interview, it just it really warms my heart to be able to do something to help others while still spreading a positive message and trying to be a role model, you know? That is like my goal in life is to just help people and just help them through hard times or be their inspiration to be the best person that it can be. And Rebel! You guys haven't seen Rebel in my videos for a while. He just came in my room. He really needs a haircut. He is hot dog. Are you a hot dog? <laughs> He's like, hot dogs? Yum. Where? Hot dog? <laughs> Are you a floppy hot dog boy? You're all fluffy? Fluffy hot dog boy. I had a blast and I'm exhausted and I was like sweating all day. I was like hoping that these people who were hugging me weren't like, ew, she's so sweaty and gross. <laughs> it's okay. I sprayed a lot of perfume on those so at least I smelled decent. <laughs> Or at least I like to think I did. Anyway, I'm gonna let you guys go. I feel like my makeup is just slowly melting off of my face. So I'm just gonna go wipe this canvas and I will talk to you guys another day. I don't know when that's gonna be, so we'll see. But thank you for watching this video and supporting me. Even if you didn't come to the meetup, I just wanna thank you guys so much for just even watching this video. This really means a lot to me and I've grown so much in six years and to be able to take steps like this is just so invigorating and so exciting and fun and it's it's an amazing thing to experience and to go through and to just have that growth and do these things and all while, you know, spreading a positive message and an inspiring message and that is ultimately like my goal in life is to inspire and help others. So. Yes, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. And I will talk to you all in my next video. <laughs> so, until then, say it with me. You gotta say it with me. So long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. Alright, bye!